What's up guys, Shane Starnes here with Droid Modder X. In the world of technology, you get what you pay for. The OnePlus 5 is under $500 and the Galaxy S8 is much more expensive, but there again, you get what you pay for. These are my top five reasons that the Galaxy S8 is better than the OnePlus 5. Let's go ahead and get started. The first and most important reason for me personally is the fact that the OnePlus 5 does not work on Verizon. Now it does have some CDMA compatibility. That compatibility only covers two out of three LTE bands and the band that is missing means that your phone will not work indoors, which you're probably indoors most of the time that you're using your phone anyway. Next up is the design. The OnePlus 5 is featuring an older 2016 design while the Galaxy S8 sports a modern 2017 design. The Galaxy S8 was one of the first phones to market with a bezel-less display and it has those sexy curves on both sides of the phone and even on the back which just make it look elegant and sleek. Don't get me wrong, the iPhone set, I mean OnePlus 5, it looks really good and even features a metal and glass design but in my opinion, the Galaxy S8 beats the OnePlus 5 when it comes to design. The third reason that the Galaxy S8 is better than the OnePlus 5 has to do with the camera, but it's not the full-on camera. It's the fact that the Galaxy S8 includes optical image stabilization, which the OnePlus 5 lacks. When you're shooting video, you will notice the difference between the OnePlus 5 and the Galaxy S8, simply because the OnePlus 5 will generate shakier video, whereas the Galaxy S8 is able to record much smoother, less shaky footage, thanks to that integrated optical image stabilization. The OnePlus 5 does include a telephoto lens in its dual lens setup, but even with that, some people are reporting image blur, and that happens when there's no optical image stabilization. When it comes to extra features, the Galaxy S8 has the OnePlus 5 beat by a long shot. The Galaxy S8 does include IP68 waterproofing, which means that you can submerge your phone up to 10 meters of water for 30 minutes. The OnePlus 5 has no waterproofing. The Galaxy S8 does feature wireless charging. The OnePlus 5 has a metal case and therefore does not include wireless charging. The Galaxy S8 also includes expandable storage. The OnePlus 5 has no expandable storage and the list goes on and on. The fifth reason that the Galaxy S8 is better than the OnePlus 5 is that QHD display. The OnePlus 5 still has a 1080p display. There is nothing wrong with a 1080p display. It still looks gorgeous and most people can't really tell the difference anyways, but when you put a QHD display next to a 1080p display, you can tell the difference in resolution and the Galaxy S8 happens to come out on top. As a bonus, the OnePlus 5 still has USB 2.0. It also has USB Type-C, so we're wondering why didn't you just go ahead and upgrade it to USB 3.0 since that is now the industry standard. The Galaxy S8 does have USB 3.0, which essentially means you're going to get much faster transfer speeds over USB with the Galaxy S8. As you can see, when you pay two or three hundred dollars more for a phone like the Galaxy S8, you're obviously going to get more features, and in this case, an over overall better experience. Now the OnePlus 5 is still an incredible device and I've even done a video showing why the OnePlus 5 is better than the Galaxy S8. The OnePlus 5 does have some very attractive features and you'll want to be sure to check that video out. I'll have a link in the description. That about wraps it up for this video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.